You waited for me to be at my worst to do what you had to do. We came home from the party and I could barely walk. That's the most vulnerable I have ever been my entire life. You even tried to help me. You actually carried my weak body into the living room. You knew I had no control and that's the moment you chose. You're a slut. No respect for yourself, for me, for anybody. You took something that had been mine for the past four years and you made it your own. I trusted you. I trusted what we had. So how did it feel? How did it feel the moment he took you into my bedroom? How did it feel when he gently took off your clothes and he started to kiss you? What else did he do? Did he uh, whisper sweet nothings into your right ear or, or was it the left one? Do you know what? I'm starting to think if this was the first time this had happened. I felt so sick that night. And not because I was so drunk that I could barely stand on my own two feet, but because the moment I burnt myself in that kitchen and you came running in after you heard me screaming in agony, you both knew what you had just been doing. In fact, I'm convinced that despite seeing me lying on that kitchen floor with burns all over me, you still were on a high from the orgasm he gave you. In fact, I'm convinced that it took you quite some time to recompose yourself and really grasp the horror that had just happened to me. And the irony, the irony of you calling the ambulance to come and rescue me. What, was that your little redemption to make yourself feel better? And how are you feeling? Any guilty feelings? I hope so. I hope you feel guilty until the day you die. I hope that this guilt eats away at you so that you can't sleep. In fact, I hope you never manage to sleep until you fully understand what you've done to me. Do you know what's weird? In the whole seven years of our friendship, I've never seen you act like this. I could never have imagined that you were capable of this. What? What? Don't you dare tell me to be mad at him. What we had was far more deeper, far more significant, much more than, much more than a mutual understanding, much more than sisters, much more than friends. I cared more about our friendship, more than I cared about my relationship with that bastard. You've not only disappointed me, You've killed me. Everything I was, everything, everything I had, everyone I loved, it's all gone. And today, today should have been the one day that I could have come to you for reassurance, for encouragement. And instead, I'm, I'm standing here saying all this horrible stuff to you nothing and I mean nothing can erase the pain you've put me through these scars are here forever and they'll forever remind me of that night they'll forever remind me of, of you of him of you two being together doing whatever you did you hurt me and I hope you both rot in hell.